Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I had a request. Uh, someone wanted to know how I rearrange the icons on my iX14 desktop. So let's see if we can get into Android. We're in the task manager. The square button is the task manager. Round button is home and the triangle is back. So let's drag Airware off the screen and drag this off the screen. And so now when you click the task manager, nothing's running. You click the home, you're back to home. Okay. So to put an app up here, you drag the screen up so that you can see all of your apps. And say to put Gmail on your home screen, you touch and hold and when you start dragging, you'll see that the grid shows up for the home screen. And you can drop it right there. And so to get rid of an app, you press and hold on it and click this X. And it'll tell you that it was removed and you can undo it. And then after a certain period of time, that goes away. So that's how easy it is to add a icon or an app to the main screen and to get rid of it. If you click and hold or press, I'm using a computer to control my transmitter. So a lot of times I say click because that's what I'm doing. I'm using a mouse. But if I want to get rid of Nova settings, I just tap that X and it's off. If I want to put that app back, then I scroll the screen up and that was the Nova settings. So I can actually use the one that's in the uh, most recently used bar. Hold down and start dragging and drop it where you want it. And I've wondered what this vertical bar was and why the airware is in it. It could be out here, but when it is, it shows airware. And it'd be nice if you could put it, oops, I didn't wait long enough when I pressed. It would be nice if I could put it right there and not be in this bar. But that's the dock, as they call it. Um, on a cell phone, it may make more sense for this dock and bar to be there. In horizontal mode on this transmitter, it kind of is abnormal for an Android, I guess. But uh, anyhow, there are settings for this dock where it... Uh, let you turn the label off. If you move it out of there and drop it somewhere else, then uh, the name shows up because the names are turned on in this area. Anyway, mine stays right there with no name. It boots automatically. I don't have to touch it and start it but if you drag it off the screen in task manager you do have to tap it to start it but you know what it is because you can recognize the icon so anyway that's about it thanks for watching catch y'all later